5.30 in the morning at Munich Airport. All planes are on the ground. Regulations prohibit most night flights. This is a quiet time inside the airport too. Most people waiting for flights are asleep. Those willing to pay 15 euros per hour can sleep on cots in little cabins. The duty-free shops are getting ready for the rush of passengers soon to come. The most regular customers at the Gucci shop are Thais and Chinese. Every day, around 25 flights from Asia land in Munich. This bag costs 1,100 euros. How oh, practically a giveaway. Yeah, for some it is. The boutique next door is already doing business. Russian travelers are shopping before returning home. We have uh, a problem with the rubles. And uh, um, in, um, we have a, a very higher prices in St. Petersburg. Delta for Alpha? On patrol on the landing field, Gerhard Schütz is in charge of traffic and security here today. Someone in our department is on duty around the clock for whatever comes up. Two days ago we had a medical stopover, a British plane from London en route to Delhi. Pilots like to use Munich for stopovers because our runway is four kilometers long. The current challenge is the arrival of heads of state and government for the G7 summit. Airport security has been conferring with the American Secret Service for more than a year. For security reasons, airport president Michael Kerklo can't tell us which runways are blocked to traffic. He's under a lot of pressure. Germany wants to show that here, as with everything else, we are really well organized. So a lot of importance is placed on everything functioning properly. The G7 summit will be an acid test for Munich Airport.